Rachel is finally here. We're getting married today and I'm beyond excited. I haven't been able to think straight for a while because I've been looking forward to this day so much and just wanting it to get here. The kids were little back on West Ridge. Andrew comes in and I will never forget this. I don't know, he was maybe six, seven. He came in, he was so disgusted. Mom, I said, what honey? Brian likes Rachel. I said, I said, baby, that's okay, that's good. We're supposed to like everybody. No, Mom, you don't understand. He like likes her. So I am just very, very excited for Rachel and Brian that that mom, Brian likes Rach, has turned into what it has. And it's just neat to watch how that's grown over the years. Brian, I love you and can't believe today is finally here. I'd like to say this is a day I've dreamed about since I was a little girl, but that'd be a lie. I was too busy outside playing basketball, street hockey, and bike tag with my future husband. I remember a student asking me one summer while I was interning at church if I thought I'd get married. Without thinking, I remember responding, yeah, of course. She then asked, well, do you think you know who it will be too? To which I responded, yeah, probably Brian. From the time you put a Do You Like Me note in the peg of my bike to the Tin Roof concert finally bringing us together, somewhere in my mind I knew I was going to marry you. I'm so grateful for our friendship that turned into something more, and I can't wait to see what our future holds. Dear God, please watch over Brian and Rachel. Please help them to follow your lead. Please help them to always remember your love for them and their love for each other. Help them to love you and love others. And God bless Rachel and Brian. Amen. I was a minister of the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ in accordance with the laws of the state of Tennessee. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Brian, you may kiss your beautiful bride. Come on, let's give it up. Yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, for the very first time, I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Brian Grizzard. Since before we even knew Rachel, Brian has always been a constant in her life, and ours too when we'd visit Rachel in Nashville. But it was towards the end of our college career when we realized it could be more than just a friendship between Rachel and Brian, and apparently our instincts were correct because here we are today. We could not be happier to celebrate Rachel and Brian, so here's to friends falling in love and living happily ever after. To Rachel and Brian.
I'm looking forward to growing in our relationship with each other and our relationship with God. I love you, Brian Gazard. Let's go get married.